Howdy, folks. Shabby's back, and he's back to walk across the treacherous ice of Forlorn Muskeg. Let's see what happens. Let's see what Shabby does. I have no idea. I really don't know what he's going to do. All right. So I think we had a bunch of... Let's, let's leave our guts here. I know I have guts on me. Leave it back here so we can see it when we enter the cave. Always recommend stepping back away from the entrance a little bit because sometimes when you walk in, you'll be right on top of your stuff that you left and you won't see it. So just take a few steps back. Alright, I think it's early so we can... Um, I think we can just go. I think we can just go. And I think it's calm, if I remember correctly it's it's actually calm out there so this would be a perfect time to make a break for it make a break for broken railroad get it nailed it once again shabby you're just bringing the funny every time this poor wolf just melting melting into the ice or into the snow all right this is a cool this is a cool zone really like the zone in this when you get weather like this it's Extra nice. Extra nice. Chiggity! Get out of here! Where you been, man? Where you been? Holy smokes. I haven't seen you in a long time, man. Under a rock. Well, I'm glad you're out from under your rock. Unless it was cozy in there. Uh, I still quote you every now and then. Riding dirty. <laughs> I always say that. I know it's not a direct quote from you, but it's applied to the long dark. It's 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 a it's a quote from you. So okay, we are riding a little bit dirty right now. We have a piece of meat on us. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> good. I've been I've been doing good. Um, I'm just I started streaming again about I don't know about three months ago. I just I was doing YouTube stuff for a bit and I kind of got burned out, and uh, so I just decided to I don't know I think I think sort of the um, the recording the way I'm recording now is is working really well I'm I'm recording myself on Twitch and then I just post it right up to YouTube and it's working out really nice. It's a lot less editing, and it's a little bit, I guess, rougher. It's more raw, I guess. Um, and there's a lot of, you know, stuff I would like to edit out, but uh, I guess the sacrifice is, is good. Where you been? Are you back on Twitch? What's going on? Can I cross here? I hope I can. I think I can get... Uh, I think I can get over towards the... I think there's one spot where you can cross here, somewhere, I want to say. Might have gone too far. You've gone too far, Shabby. Oh, looks like there's a maple over there. Can you get to this? Let's see if we can get to this island. I don't think we can. Let's just try it. Let's just try it. Yeah. No dice. No dice. Took a year off. To work on myself and my mental health, always important. But I'm back streaming again, sweet. All right, man. We'll help you, you know, recharge the batteries, sorted some things out, you know. I mean, I had some, I definitely had some ups and downs in the past couple years. And, uh, you know, you just want to sort of, yeah, just sort of focus on yourself a little bit absolutely very important to do um yeah I don't think I can cross I want to get over there but oh wait wait here we go here we go this is the spot this is the spot I was thinking of oh okay so you were doing that too yeah I just sort of I don't know kind of stumbled upon this um, kind of by accident, sort of. 
Yeah, it is nice. It is nice, and I'm gonna uh, not waste it. I'm gonna take advantage of this. So what we're doing here is, uh, oh my gosh, that's a terrible shot. Uh, we still got him though. Archery five, you know, it's very forgiving. Um, so what I've been doing is, um, I got all the new recipes. I found all the new recipes. Uh, just recently found number nine in Bleak Inlet. And then at the same time, we're also doing all the signal void bunkers. And so now, now that I've got the ninth recipe, I'm headed back to Forsaken Airfield to get the last, the last signal void uh, bunker. Oh, you don't know anything about the new stuff? There's a lot of cool additions, I think. Um, just the signal void stuff is pretty sweet. It's almost like that. There's like a little quest line in a sandbox, which kind of makes it. I don't know, it just gives you something to do. I was saying when I, when I first started this run that I was suffering from too much to do itis because you had you had the signal void stuff and then all the new recipes that they added. And you have to sort of just run around and try to find those. So there's just there's a ton of stuff to do right now. And I'm kind of I'm kind of getting towards the end of it, although now that I think about it, I haven't done any of the new fishing stuff either. So that the fishing stuff will come after I finish the signal void. And there's a bunch of new stuff for for the uh, there's a bunch of new fishing stuff too. So I haven't even looked at that. There's a ton of ton of things, tons. Like looking for feathers in the grass, you know? That's something else. That's something fun. You have to literally be, like, right on top of it. Uh, I just found one. Okay, whatever. Moving on. Oh, you're playing Starfield. Sweet. Are you enjoying that? I, uh... I'm debating on playing that or Baldur's Gate 3. I just don't know which one I want to do. Uh, I kind of want to just wrap this up a little bit. I kind of want to play this for another couple more weeks, and then I think I'm gonna... Um... I think I'm gonna probably do Baldur's Gate 3. But I don't know. Let's just pop in here and just see if we left anything that's valuable. I doubt it, but some water, I guess. We grab a grab a little drink. There's a lantern. We don't have one of those. Maybe we should just grab this lantern. Did you? So it sounded like you used to play some battlefield type games. I played, uh, in, um, I guess it's pretty different than Starfield, though, actually, now I think about it. I just haven't played a shooter, like a first person shooter type game, in a freaking forever. I used to play, um, I forgot what it's called Star Wars. Is this called Star Wars Battlefield? Is that what it's called? I played the hell out of that. I don't... Is it, is it Battlefield? Battlefront. That's it. Battlefront. I love that. The first one was awesome. The first one was amazing. The music... This the, I always think about the music for some reason. I don't know why, I just thought the music was so good. I'm afraid to go across here. I think it's thin ice. No? No, looks like we got it. Best bit. Oh, I loved it. I love that. That was the best. That was the best board. I love that. I love that. Oh man. I was always like. Now this is before they got it got nerfed, but I would play the jetpack and the um, whatever that crossbow thing was. I played that a ton. I love I love that setup. That was my favorite setup. You could just like rain hell down on people, and it was awesome.
Okay, I don't think I can cross here, but let's just try it. Oh, look at this. Okay. All right. We're, oh, there's a bear. Let's let's go this way. There's a bear over there. I think he smells this. <laughs> okay. Oh. Man, this is amazing weather. Amazing weather. Getting a little too close to that bear for comfort. He's going to the spot where he smelt us, so... Every time I say smelt, I think dealt. Smelt it, dealt it. <laughs> I don't know. That's where my brain immediately goes. I played the second I played the second battlefront and it just it was okay. I just I don't know, maybe I was getting burned out on it, but I just didn't seem to have the same magic for some reason. You did the rhyme did the crime. <laughs> I have not heard that one, but it's that's a good one. That's good. Alright, there's yeah, there's oftentimes a a uh snow shelter here for some reason this doesn't usually have maybe you like get a can of food or something every now and then but that's about it I mean some shoes too but we don't need shoes but that's the only I think that's the pretty much the only, oh we've already been here oh okay well that's why there wasn't any food there I remember, I remember coming here. I came here and then and then a blizzard kicked in and then I went across the, I went to the tracks and there was a bear on the tracks and then I fell through the ice and I got a little gnarly there for a bit, but we made it. So what, so you're playing Star, you're playing Starfield is it, what's your sort of general, what's your hot take on Starfield? It's pretty huge, I guess. Probably still trying to figure out what's, what's going on, I would imagine. I'll definitely keep a lookout for you on Twitch, though. Now, now that I know you're back, let's see. Let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. I'm not gonna deal with them. I would like to. Maybe we'll get a mag lens. I hope to get a mag lens. And bro, because this torch is gonna go out. It's definitely a Bethesda game. So much loot and NPCs and things to do. I'm eight hours in and really like it. Sweet. Yeah, you're you're just still starting. You're still just scratching the surface. Yeah, there's something about NPCs and Beth in Bethesda games that are just there's a there's a certain Bethesda ness to the, to them. Perfect. I don't think we're going to need any warming teas. Let's just chill here for a bit and warm up just a smidge and then we'll keep going. We got plenty of water. Actually, probably just too heavy right now. No, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. I think I might uh Let's just have it. Let's just have a coffee. Because I just love coffee so much. Oh, we have three cups here, so let's let's cook one of them. We don't need to cook it, but this is warming up. I 
I'm gonna do the old bedroll trick. And we'll just, boom, just give ourselves a little bump. Just, just a little bump. All right, let's go. Oh, look at the weather changed on us. Yeah, I've been I've been doing these streams for about three months, and I just do them for about an hour at a time. I don't do hardcore stuff. I have my I have my raids limited to fifteen people. You know, I don't want I you know obviously I don't have any. I have no bells or whistles, neither bell nor whistle uh, on my stream. Um, so I just I just use it as a way to kind of hang with people, play a little long dark for a bit, and also record it just it saves a lot on my on my storage space on my computer so it's nice yeah you turned your stuff off too I just I don't like a big crowd I, I just I'm not set up for it yeah exactly exactly I had someone I had a bot come on to my stream yesterday and I didn't know it until like the second time around but they were like Hey, I'm a visual artist, and uh, they started asking me questions about the game, and uh, and then I'm like, okay, and I was I was telling them like, hey, I'm not really the best place to promote things, you know, I don't really I'm not really set up for that kind of you're barking up the wrong tree kind of thing, and then and then they were quiet for a long time, and then like and then I started getting the same questions over again, and then I realized like, oh, this is a bot, oh shit, <laughs> so. Oh, did they? Oh, interesting. Interesting. You got hit with a bot as well. I don't want to say the na name just because I don't want to... I just, you know... Obviously, we don't want to keep per perpetuating... Oh, okay. Yeah, um, that was not the name of this person. Whoa! Oh, dang it! Wow, scared me. Give me the bejeet, scare the bejesus out of me. I'm not gonna shoot it because we don't need to. Actually, now to think about it, we are gonna be coming back through here pretty soon. That's a, it's all right. It's fine. Were they? Did they say that they were a? Okay, go ahead. Yeah, man. We can talk later. All right, so here's a little, probably the me the most well-known shortcut in in TLD right here. But it did I did not know about this for a long time until I started watching people play and like, oh, you can. There is a little shortcut here. Otherwise, you have to kind of go way around, and it's a little bit of a pain. And there's really not a whole lot. Of loot over there there might be like a corpse maybe a backpack and that's about it you know besides your foraging type stuff but I don't think there's even cattails over there so it's kind of just a just a long detour of nothing that's what I'm gonna put on my on my um that's gonna be my epitaph a long detour of nothing <laughs> okay all right, I'm not that depressed. So it's okay. I think we went down that way last time. Let's go around this way. You never know. We do have a... Uh, there is an arrow. Our, our, our first lost arrow on this run is somewhere in this zone, and it's probably just... It'll never be found. I, I'd say there's, you know, almost a 0% chance we'll find it, but you never know. You never know. Here we go. Now, that's that's a nice healthy amount of of uh 
feathers. Sorry, I just blanked on the word feathers for some reason. There's a couple of these little side detour places, and um, this isn't the one I was thinking of when I first came over here. I thought it was, there's a spot where there's like a camp, there's like a abandoned campfire and a corpse or something, something like that. Must be further up here. I mean, as long as the weather stays like this, we should just keep on sort of looking around and seeing what we can find. Now, where are these crows? I don't wear headphones, so it's... Oh, it's flyover crows. Okay, of course! I recommend wearing headphones, but uh, I just I have a little ear thing that I don't like to. I don't like to wear headphones, but you can locate things so much better. You can hear a lot more with headphones. I might invest in some really nice ones. I think that those would probably be okay for me. Alright. I don't know where that little side passage was. It must have been early on. It must have been earlier in, in the zone. Because we're definitely past the spot I was thinking of. Must be before the landslide, I guess. Alright. Broken Railroad, here we are. We got a ton of food here. Um, I mean, I don't really necessarily need to stop here, but let's just go down here and just see, where, see what we have. How things are looking. I know, and again, I know we have a ton of food here, so... Might as well just pop in here. The weather's really nice. Of course, there's gonna be wolves everywhere. Probably should clear out the wolves while the weather's nice like this. kind of looking around for arrows on the ground because I know it probably died around here somewhere all right he got spooked he heard shabby's in the town and he made a run for it he hightailed it out let's check out this truck over here I'm not sure if I searched it yet No. I left a lot of this kind of stuff. I have not been very thorough in my looting at all. Oh. Well, that was weird. Oh, we have been in here. I just didn't check the... Okay. I just didn't check the back. Again, not very thorough in my looting. There we go. I knew there was one around here somewhere. Let's see. Let's get on a flatter surface. Oh, here you go. Here he is. Here he is. Okay. All right, buddy. Let's do this. There we go. Just bounces off her face. And we could get a little bit of meat off of that wolf, and I think we'd have some fixins for some stalker pie. Probably the most disgusting food in the game right now. 
bear meat and wolf meat bleh, in a pie. Gross. <laughs> Alright. I'm just going to get a fire going just because I don't. I'm not sure if I want to keep keep the flames alive or not. I'm just not sure. Let's see what our wa on, water Come situation on. is. We have a, a decent amount of water. Probably wouldn't hurt to make some more water. Okay. There we go. Alright. Got a cured moose out here. Got some bear meat. Um, let's go and get some... Look at these three pry bars. And I have one on me. Oh, I forgot to leave it. I was going to leave this in Forlorn Musket. It doesn't matter. We'll just have four pry bars here. Uh. Alright, we probably can make some... I probably will just make... We have all these acorns. I probably will make some acorn stuff while we're here. We already have two here also. Can of soup. Um, let's go and get some. Let's go and get some bear, uh, some um, wolf meat. While it's nice, I saw we just had some. Um, we have some uh, ptarmigan. No, sorry, we we had some rabbit and and rabbit and uh oh my gosh deer meat over there so we can make the briar house pie if we got some ptarmigans that wouldn't be a bad plan either There's a big pile of moose meat over there where I shot the moose that I didn't bring back. So we could also bring some moose meat over here. So much to do. Okay, so here's the... Let's see what we got here. We got... Oh, we have it right here. We have all the fixins. Briar house pie right there. Maybe we should make that. And that'll just take us right on into... Right on into uh, Forsaken Airfield. So let's um, I wouldn't mind getting the um, moose steaks over here. I think there'll be enough on that fire to do that. Let's just go. Hang on, let me drop some weight. Oh, we have a lot. Just for emergency purposes, I guess. Took our corn over here with us, didn't we? Oh, we have four liters of water. Oh my goodness. So much. It's hard to get organized. I, I'm feeling. I'm starting to feel overwhelmed right now. We are going for a meat run, so let's drop some more weight. Not gonna need that. Definitely aren't gonna need those. Alright, come on, Shabby. We gotta hustle. Let's hustle. Alright, let's go. It's not too far. It's just right up here. Now look at this. We have, we have, we have some wolf activity. There's wolves all over the place.
Now we we shot the moose kind of close to this deer carcass because I was confused and thought the deer carcass was the moose or something. Look at this. That's a wolf, those are wolf tracks. All right, here here we go. Oh, boom, boom. There we go. Oh, there's more in the grass. Can you imagine in real life just pulling, just picking up meat? Just meat that's been there for weeks. Just in the grass, just pull it out of the grass. Pretty gross. Not as gross as stalker pie, though. I'm not sure I can carry much more. So the, I don't see any moose right now. Okay. Is he after me now or what? I just heard a wolf. I thought it was going after the deer, but I guess I guess not. Maybe those were deer tracks I was seeing, not wolf tracks. I didn't look super close. So yeah, I think I'm gonna make a briar house. And um, we'll just chill here for tonight. And then um, we'll head on to Forsaken in the morning. No reason to linger other than maybe making some, uh, we could make some acorn type stuff. Make some acorn grounds. That stuff's pretty useful. Got the chill music. Always good. Ooh, look at this. I'm surprised. I'm really surprised there's no wolves. We'll just put make our meat pile over here. Now moose steaks you can't make. You can't make any kind of special. Oh, these are. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, these are the bear steaks. These are moose. Okay, got it. Okay, we got crap everywhere. I'm taking these. Because I don't think we have any at the at the Forsaken Airfield. Pretty sure. I'm going to put this crap in a drawer. Let's see, we have some more over here too. Put some crap in a drawer. Okay. Is this done? Okay. Oh! Hurry! Hurry, Shabby. Hurry. Alright. We're gonna make some Briar House pie and then I'm gonna call it a night. Come on, little fire. Let's see, we got some more sticks over here. I guess I could throw a coal on. Let's clean up this place. This is looks like this place is a mess. We got some cooked cooked items here. Oh man, I'm the worst at organizing. I am the worst.
it's hard to organize the the vegetables I found. Carrots they just carrots do not want to to play. They 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 have not come to play at all. I could eat anything right now. Okay. Let's throw a coal on. Just do it, Shabby. It's okay. It's gonna be fine. Okay, let's see what we need for Briar House. Oop. Oh. Sorry, I got a little confused there. And flour. Okay. I want to use the smaller amount. Okay. Pancakes. Look out. Oh, what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no. We don't have enough. Oh, no. Oh, man. We got to make this. Okay. I do know where there's some rat... Um, I know where there's some de deer. We'll just harvest that carcass. Shoot. Let's do it right now because it's it's the weather's nice. That's what I'm thinking at least. Pot. Okay. Let's go. I like having the briar house because it's one piece of food and it almost will fill you up 100% and it's so it's really nice to travel with it. You don't have to carry a lot of food. And it'll, I guess it has one stink. Is it only one stink? I don't know. It's got three pieces of meat in it, but it's it only has one stink. So that's that's also another advantage. I wonder if it has the best, like, calories in to calories out ratio. Because there's probably, there's definitely more calories that you get out of it than, than you actually put into it. So, wait, what was that out there? I saw, is that the moose? What the hell is that? Is that the moose out there? What am I seeing? I think that's the moose. is a weird spot. I didn't know it would be on the ice like that. It's, it's bizarre. I'll have to look at that. Surrounded by snow. Nothing to drink. Alright. What? Oh, it's a wolf eating a deer. It didn't look like a moose. It looked kind of like a moose, but I couldn't quite... It looked like... I don't know. It was weird looking to me. Not the best eyesight in the world, but... That was the best I could do was a moose. Okay, we gotta get some rabbits now. Rabbits are over by the... train car thing over there. Well, as stinky as we are, uh, I'm just assuming there's no there's no wolves around here. Just 
dusk, so I can't be far behind. All right. I'm going to do something a little risky. I'm going to go ahead and get some rabbits right now. Let's get some uh so we're just we're just doing nothing here. Let's let's make some water, I guess. Oop. Four torches, that should be enough to get us over there and back. Nope. We don't stink, let's just go for it. I might be I might be being overconfident here. I don't know if this is smart, but I think we'll be okay. probably gonna be just hanging here for on this session I won't I'm probably not gonna leave until I, I play tomorrow or something have you heard about the crab walk exploit you can walk faster crab walking which is sort of this diagonal walk All the speed, all the speed run folks are talking about that right now. And apparently, the controllers you can walk even faster than the keyboard. The 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 yeah the controllers, you can walk even faster than you can with controllers. So it was just it was so much of an advantage that it's been outlawed. It's been banned for speed runs. I'm gonna keep my eyes open for some uh, for a wayward lost probably laying in the grass arrow it probably wasn't in here because I walked through here many a time so um, when there was actually a wolf carcass associated with it it was I think it's probably gonna be off to the right towards the lake but I'm not gonna look for it it's pointless you'll never find it you just will never find it okay now there's bunny rabbits hopping around here somewhere let's go in here and just get a fire just so I can save my save my, my matches Come on, little fire. Oh, that was woefully short. There we go. Oh, that one was short. I'm going to get that one because I'm going to lose it if I don't. Where's the other arrow? Here we go. All right, how big is this rabbit? Hope nobody needs this anymore. Oh, let's see. Let's look at it. Oh, okay. All right, that's enough for two whole pies. So let's just let's just take it. Tempted to go around that way, but nah, it's okay. Actually, we could go this way and just drop down. I think it's shorter. I'm 
Wow, the weather has been amazing. I can tell you I'm a little disappointed in the wolves here. They they just really They're just lazy. They're lazy. They they used to guard this you know very well. They were uh what's the word I'm thinking of? Vigilant. They were they were vigilant in their duty to guard this building and they are they are failing. Absolutely failing. Okay. Let's get some meat off of this. Probably have to throw some coal in here. Hey, shiggity. I'm about to quit, actually. Um, because I've decided... I've. I mean, if the next sort of logical place to go from here is Forsaken Airfield, and that's just too far for me for... I, just, I usually just play for an hour. So I'm coming up on, you know, 50 minutes right now. So we're going to make some pie. We're going to make some Briar House pie. I'll show you some of the... the one of the new recipes. Um, let's see. This is a pretty good one. It's, it's not the best, but it has a ton of calories. Uh, this one right here. It's got almost... It's got 2,100 calories. Huge. For what you put into it, you put in some half a kilo of ptarmigan, rabbit, and venison. Which is probably... I don't know, I didn't look, but let's see how much... How many calories is in this. So half of this is 450. So, probably like about... I'd say probably about, you're probably putting in about 1,200 calories into this dish and you get uh, 2,100 back, so it's pretty damn good. Uh, we need some venison and some flour, okay. I thought I had flour. Oh, here's some. There we go. All right, let's do it. Look at that. Beautiful. Making pies. Can you believe it? We're making pies in TLD. It's pretty fun. I, I do, I, I'm enjoying the cooking. I really am enjoying, enjoying the cooking. I gotta get... I gotta tidy this place up, man. This is my worst. This is probably the worst aspect of, of my gameplay is tidying up a, a, a base. I'm just I'm just so terrible, terrible. We got to take a lot of this coal with us. I'm gonna grab this right now. Um, we could make some arrows. Let's see what our bow condition is. 57%. It's probably okay. Any kind of stew? We, maybe we can make a stew. I haven't made a stew yet. Let's see what kind of stew action we have. Venison stew. That just gives you some rest. Hmm. Yeah, I don't want to waste stuff. We do have all of this. We have all these ingredients as well. We could make...
And we have the corn. We could make this. Okay, well, whatever. <laughs> uh, I think we're a potato short, that looks like. Oh, boy. We're a potato short. As, you know, as the saying goes. A day late and a potato short. Something like that. Um, I don't know. Let's just cook some moose meat. Just to be doing something. Here we go. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Okay, that's it. Can finish harvesting this guy up. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> they they look like little rabbit. They look like little rabbit. Uh, whatever you call them. Filets? Pieces of meat? I don't know. Potatoes! Okay. They look like kidney beans or something. Or not kidney beans, but like the... Oh yeah, see, I'm hovering over them now. It's a little disturbing. It's a little pink. It's too pink. Or something. Just put my guts right next to my pies, as one does. Don't starve, Shabby. Don't starve. Don't starve. Oh, we, we burned it! Oh no! Oh no, we burned it! No! Oh no, I thought it said that there was 30 minutes left on it. It must have been it must have been 30 minutes until burned. Oh lord. Oh wow. Oh, we don't have enough ptarmigan now to do it. Oh. <laughs> no. Oh, that's devastating. I thought it said 30 minutes until it was done. It must have said burned. Uh, I'm just goofing off too much. Wow, I'm devastated. I'm devastated. Oh, what do I do? Just cry, I guess. I can just make some more. I have to get some more ptarmigans, though. That's what sucks. Okay, well, I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I think I gotta... I'm, I'm not... Uh, I'm just gonna have to sit and think about that mistake for a bit. Let's just cook some moose meat. I hate that... I'm just gonna pick these up. Get them out of the way. Let's just cook them like this. Okay. Alright, well let's tidy up our inventory. Um, I'll do what I can around here, but it's not... Don't... Keep your expectations low. This is this is about as good as it gets for me right here. This is it. Um, okay. All right, that's all set. Let's go in here. Let's get our inventory all situated. It was just going to go to my hips. <laughs> that's true. You know what? Future Astrid is going to thank me. You know? Because, what is it? Skin there's... What's this? There's some saying like, skinny... There's nothing that tastes as good, or feels as good. There's nothing that you're going to eat as, that's going to feel as good as being skinny. It's something like that. I don't know. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I live by that. I live by that. <laughs> oh, the pressure we put on ourselves. It's terrible. Okay. Got 
lot of a lot of torch harvesting to do. And on on into the night, late into the night, just breaking up torches. Wow, I'm just I'm I'm still I'm still dwelling on the on the briar house debacle. We're gonna have to recover. We'll have to recover from that somehow. So yeah, so the plan now is um, tomorrow we will start traveling to Forsaken Airfield. I'll get situated down there in the in the um, in the hangar. Then we're gonna go up to Justy's cabin, something like that. Justy's cabin, and then we're gonna wait for an aurora, and then we'll go do the final bunker, and hopefully get the technical balakalava. And I'm not 100% sure it's available on Interloper, but I'm just hoping that it's. I'm hoping that it is. We'll see. And that'll be pretty much, you know, a big, kind of my overall goal of this whole run will be complete by that point. And then we'll, then we'll just do fishing. Then we'll just be on a fishing trip for the rest of the game. Until I get sick of it and then I'll start a new run. Of course, this all depends on us surviving. So I always have to, can't, can't ever assume that you're just going to survive. Still got to do that part. Okay, let's separate your meats. Separate your meats. Put the cooked stuff over here. I can't wait to fish. I'm excited about that. Because there's, there's a whole bunch of new stuff for fishing. I'll show you some there's they have fishing lures now fishing lures um, they have these fishing tip-ups which means that you can fish and not have to actively fish you can set the tip up it's more like a trap it's like a trap and so you're not actively fishing you, you can set this and then you can do some cooking or whatever um, and then come back to this later which may, that really changes the that really changes everything with fishing. You can even bait. You can put bait on the fishing tip up or on your fishing tackle. And I don't even know how that works yet, so I'm not sure. But I know that there's bait now, which is like little tiny little pieces of meat you can put on there. Um, is that it? That might be it. As far as the fishing part goes, here's another lure. You know, it's just a piece of scrap metal. I think that's all the new stuff. And then there's also this. Uh, you can actually make a fishing spot, a fishing hole right here. Anywhere. Well, not anywhere, but in a in a spot where you can fish. Just out on, you don't need a fishing uh, hut anymore to do fishing. So, yeah, I remember you did fishing. Actually, you were the first person I realized that you could ruin your clothes. Yeah. Yeah. Not anywhere, but just in places where you can fish, you can put a you can just break a hole in the ice and start fishing. Which is pretty sweet. But yeah, you were the first person uh that I realized that uh that uh I was watching you when you discovered that your clothes could get ruined in a just sitting in a fishing hut. But because I, I do remember you did quite a bit of fishing back in the day. Um, all right, let's look at our inventory real quick, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna stop here for today. All right, we'll sort this out. I gotta I gotta figure out if I need to take flour or not. Um, I think what we'll do in the morning first thing is make pancakes just just to settle. You know, settle everything. Maybe make some coffee and some pancakes. Yeah. DP Bleak? Yeah, I don't know. I never fit. I don't know if I've ever fished in Bleak Inlet. 
pretty sure I have never fished in Bleak Inlet. Um, yeah, Desolation Point, you couldn't, there wasn't a fishing hut in Desolation Point, and, but now you probably can, I don't know, but I bet if you get to the right spot, you can probably, um, make a fishing hole somewhere on the ice. Oh, and they have new fish, too, which I'm not even, I don't even know all of them yet. There's like, I think there's like, I want to say five or six new fish that you can catch now. So that's kind of fun, too. Yep. But anyways, uh, we're going to stop here. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and sleep for 10 hours. Actually, you know what? We don't have to recover health. Let's just sleep for 6 because I want to catch the morning just in case there's a... Um, in case there's a maglens type morning. You want to come back? <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's fun. It's cool. There's new, I mean, there's a lot of new stuff. That, I mean, you might want to, I don't know if you're like, you know, obviously Starf, uh, ooh, there was a, an Aurora. Um, I'm sure you're probably knee deep in Starfield right now, but, um, there's going to be some newer updates. There's going to be some more updates coming up in the next few months. There, it hasn't been announced, but, um, there's going to be some pretty big changes still to come as well. So pretty excited about that. All right, folks, we're going to stop here. It's cool. Hanging out, hanging out with my buddy Shiggity. Hadn't seen him in a bit. So it's cool. Uh, good to see you again. And I'll be sure to check you out if, uh, when I, when I, when I see that you're on. Okay, folks, that's it for, that's it for me. Everyone, uh, take a shabby. <laughs>